Parker and Ethan were born on September 14th, 2011. It was a normal delivery, no complications. Parker was about eight weeks old when he got sick. I knew something was off, so I decided to take him to the emergency room. Well, Parker's heart rate was about 280 beats a minute. A normal baby's heart rate is typically anywhere from 80 to 160. What we found that he had was something called an atrial ectopic tachycardia. And what that means is there was an abnormal electrical focus from the top chambers of the heart that were running the heart or telling the heart how fast to beat rather than the normal pacemaker of the heart. We had already called the surgeons to put him on what's called ECMO, which stands for extracorporeal membrane oxygenation. And really it's a heart-lung bypass machine in order to supply the, ba the baby's body with enough oxygen and blood so we could support the heart. I think the ECMO machine was buying time. Parker was 11 weeks old when the ablation was done. We were scared. There was a lot of risks. There was no other options, I felt. So the risks of the procedure are that I'm trying to use catheters that are designed for adults in a baby's heart. And I'm using this catheter, which remember I'm manipulating from his leg because this is inside his body. And I have to take this tip and find that one millimeter spot inside his top chambers that's causing this abnormal electrical impulse. Then I heat that so it can't conduct electricity anymore, and then he returns to his normal rhythm. There's really not a lot of words that can express how grateful I am for her. If it wasn't for her, I wouldn't have my son. That's how I feel. She saved his life. I'm very grateful for her. I we think that the know. likelihood of it coming back is very, very, very low. I think the team was excellent. I think Dr. Cortez um, is a very, she's a miracle worker. She, she, she performed a miracle. Children are not ill by choice. Children don't do things to themselves to make them sick. And there's nothing like doing a procedure and then getting to play with kids and singing Old MacDonald Had a Farm and Old MacDonald Had a Farm, E-I-E-I-O. No, they no. give the best hugs in the world. So um, there's a lot of benefit that I get from doing this with children. And Do I get my hug? Where's my hug? Parker Where's is about hug? seven and a half months. Um, he's doing fantastic. You would never know that he went through anything. I know you do. I have too many people to thank here at Nationwide Children's. For in, forever in debt to them, because if it wasn't for them, I don't know if he would have made it. He's one strong little boy.